My name is Hugo Soleil, and I'm the Director of HPC Marketing and Inter Industry Development at Intel. Welcome to SC15 in Austin, Texas. So you probably heard us talk quite a bit about the Scalable System Framework since April, when we first introduced it with the announcement about the Aurora Supercomputer, Supercomputer at Argonne National Labs. Uh, the Scalable System Framework is a flexible blueprint for uh, designing, procuring, deploying, and maintaining HPC solutions uh, from small to large. And it's also for both computational and data applications. So whether it's HPC or big data that you're looking to uh, deploy a system for, the Scalable System Framework will be targeted uh, towards solving your problems at all scales on those two fronts. There are four different components to the overall Scalable System Framework. There's the compute side, the fabric side, the storage side and the software side. Uh, all four of those are represented in our booth here at SC15, uh, and you can walk through and experience the overall uh, benefits and value propositions for each one of those. On Monday afternoon, we made an announcement in our booth that the OmniPath architecture uh, was launching. Uh, OmniPath is a low latency, high bandwidth, scalable fabric um, that's being delivered by Intel. It's not just a single HCA or a single plug-in card, it's the HCA, it's the switches, it's the cables, it's the software, it's the ecosystem, all coming together to deliver a low latency, high performance fabric. One of the other elements of the Scalable System Framework is storage. And at Intel, we're focusing most of our storage uh, solutions on the Lustre Parallel File System. Uh, as you know, uh, there are many bottlenecks that can crop up into a cluster. And one of the traditional bottlenecks is reading large files. With Lustre, you can stripe uh, massive files across hundreds of hard disks instead of uh, from a single one, uh, paralyzing the read and write applications uh, from the file system. We announced five different Intel Parallel Computing Centers this year uh, that are focused on advancing Lustre Parallel File System uh, software as well as uh, optimizing it for the enterprise environments. One of our key focuses at SC15 this year is focusing on the community. Uh, the HPC community is a strong, robust uh, ecosystem, lots of different players, and ultimately we're a very tight niched environment. Um, so within our booth, we have the community hub. You can see it over my right shoulder right now, where we have multiple industry luminaries coming in all day long uh, and all show long talking about the importance of HPC and how we need to work together to further the technologies. So one of the things we're, we're excited about on the community front right now is the recent announcement about the OpenHPC project, which is essentially an open source project to unify uh, uh, a lot of the, the different software out there for managing and maintaining uh, clusters. Uh, so we're very proud to be one of the uh, founding members of that organization. It has over 30 members uh, already. Uh, we're seeing great momentum and a lot of excitement on the show floor, uh, folks wanting to join uh, and participate in that project. The centerpiece of our booth is an interactive and immersive demo that's focused on using HPC for music, essentially computational music and sound. Um, hope you have a chance to stop by and take a look at it. Uh, it's running on a scalable system framework cluster. This cluster has two kinds of processors in it, next generation Xeon processor, as well as the next generation Xeon Phi processor, codenamed Knight's Landing. It also has two different fabrics in it. It has both the Intel OmniPath architecture fabric as well as Intel Ethernet. It's also running two different operating systems, the uh, Linux and Windows. It's also running a host of, other, uh, of the other elements of the Scalable System Framework, namely Lustre and Intel SSDs and a few other components. What's great about this is you have one cluster that has multiple kinds of software, multiple kinds of hardware and fabrics all running together seamlessly, running an amazing immersive experience. I encourage you to stop by and sit in the sound booth and experience it for yourself. Well, thank you so much for stopping by today at SC15. Really enjoyed having the conversation with you. I encourage you to walk around our booth, stop by again, and looking forward to seeing you next year at SC16.